Hello Internet, and today we're going to the Grand Teton National Park. These are the Idaho Falls on the Snake River. It's just under two hours from Idaho Falls to the Grand Teton National Park. I drove my Mini Cooper with a 14-foot paddleboard strapped to the top. I'm hoping I'll find a beautiful way to take the paddleboard out. The road winds its way through the river valleys, up over the mountains, to Jackson, Wyoming. Sure, I've crossed into Wyoming and I'm headed up uh, Highway 26. I also had to stop and get the paddleboard inspected at the state line. Finally, the Grand Teton. The mountains that are the mountain's majesty. I made it to the park and I found this first stop with all these uh, donkeys and the mountains in the background, so I stopped and I took some pictures. These mules made for a beautiful subject with the mountains in the background. I have numbered the photos to make it easier for you to comment your favorite photo in the comment section. Please help me out with the YouTube algorithm. Like and subscribe. must be the most majestic place I've ever done that one. One of the things that makes sunset photography challenging at the Teton National Park is that the mountains are backlit instead of frontlit like they would be in the morning. In my opinion, the best time to photograph this beautiful place is first thing in the morning. So I'm out here at the uh, signal area boat launch and I am trying to capture the moon set. I've got my camera set up here, uh, similar to what you've seen in the past. And uh, so far I've got some pretty good shots. This photo was taken prior to sunrise. As you can see, the detail is much clearer than the photos taken at sunset. Even though I had a phenomenal experience, I still recommend photographing these mountains in the morning. It was a gorgeous night. I really enjoyed watching the sunset, followed by the moon. The sunlight passing through the valleys of the mountains was majestic. The paddleboard and the cooper made for an interesting subject. I had to get the Instagram feed photo. To date, this is my best astrophotography photo. I know I can do better with practice. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.